Now let's move to the Address Book tab. Here, you can add, manage, or edit your personal address book contacts. Create custom groups to organize your contacts into logical entities. Often, custom groups are used to organize users by site or by department. There are two aspects to the address book, your personal address book and a company address book. Your company address book consists of all the users in your organization, as well as any entities created by your company system administrator. Your personal address book is completely under your control. Simply add entries from the corporate address book and then edit and organize them as you see fit. You can also create new entries from frequent contacts that are external to your organization. To add someone from your company list to your personal list, click on Search Company List. Type their name in the search box. Enable the checkbox on the left-hand side of the screen and select Copy to List. You will see the contact is now added to your personal list. To add a group, select Manage Groups, then Add Group. Once you've entered the group name, select the check mark to add the group. To add a person to a group that you've created, click on their name or select the check box next to their name. From here, you can edit their information and you can assign them a group. Save contact, you will see that they've been added to the group. To add a contact, simply select the Add Contact button and complete all of the information listed here. There are two fields on this screen that you may not be familiar with. The first one is SIP address. This is the SIP address that you use to log in to your end user portal or your telephone or your smart office clients. The SIP address is important when you want to communicate with others on the system. The second field is show presence. You have the ability to enable or disable their presence. That means that if you're on a smart office client or on your telephone, you can see what their presence is. When complete, select save contact. You can also add contacts from a file. To find the file format, click on the help button on the top right hand corner of the screen. From here, you can download the import file. Add the applicable information to the import file. Once you've updated the file, save it to a place where you can find it easily. You can now close out of the file. From here, click on Add from File, then select Upload. On the right side, you will be asked to confirm the import. Your new contacts will now be added to your list. In the address book, you also have the option to manage yourself. In this section, you can update the personal information others will see about you in the corporate address book. You can also add or remove a profile picture. Click on Manage Self. All of the information here can be updated. Show Presence should be enabled if you would like others to be able to see your presence. To add a picture, click on Add Picture. Select the file and upload the photo. Pictures should be less than 20 MBs and should be no greater than 160 by 120 pixels. Once you've uploaded your picture, remember, you need to save contact.